So today we'll be discussing ethical and responsible computing. So as computing professionals, we must consider the ethical implications of our work and recognize our responsibilities to employers, peers, clients, and the public. We will also look at some popular and current ethical concerns in computer science. So, ethical concerns in computing. Ethics in computing involves understanding and adhering to moral principles that guide our behavior in decision making and in development and use of technology. So, ethical computing ensures that our work promotes fairness um, and transparency and respect for human rights. So, responsibilities in computing. Uh, we have responsibilities to our employer. We need professional integrity to ensure that all work is completed honestly and competently. Confidentiality, and there should be safeguard prior, uh, proprietary and sensitive information. Loyalty, we act in the best interest of the employer uh, while maintaining ethical standards. We have responsibilities to our peers. Collaboration, uh, work collabor cooperatively and share knowledge. Respect, treat your colleagues with respect and fairness. And accountability, take responsibility for one's actions and contributions to a project. So let me stop. Um, we also have responsibilities to our clients. Transparency, that clearly communicate the project's progress, its costs, and potential issues. Um, it's quality. Deliver high quality and reliable products and services. Privacy. Uh, protect client data and respect their privacy. We also have responsibility to the public. Safety. Ensure that the products and systems do not cause harm. Access. Strive to make technology accessible to all. Uh, so social impact. Consider the broader social implications of technology, such as its effect on employment and privacy. Let's take a look at some uh, current issues, concerns, in computer science. Privacy and data protection. But with the rise of big data and machine learning, massive amounts of personal data are being collected and analyzed. Protecting this data from breaches and misuse is a major ethical concern. For example, the Cambridge Analytica scandal highlighted how data harvested from social media can be used unethically. Okay. Our second um, Second current ethical concerns with computer science, we have artificial intelligence and bias. AI systems can inadvertently perpetuate or amplify biases present in their training data. Ensuring that AI systems are fair and unbiased is crucial. For example, facial recognition technology has been criticized for high error rates in recognizing people of color. This actually happened when I went to the airport. We just put in your ID and it says, does your face match? Yeah, it's my ID. What the heck? Uh, cybersecurity. So, uh, as digital systems become more integral to society, the threat of cyber attacks increase, increases. So, ethical computing includes implementing robust security measures to protect against these threats. So, an example the WannaCry, uh, the WannaCry uh, ransomware attack that affected organizations worldwide the need for better cybersecurity practices. Okay. Fourth thing, intellectual property. Respecting intellectual property rights is vital in maintaining ethical standards. This includes avoiding plagiarism and providing licensing software and content. So an example, software piracy undermines the rights of the creator and can lead to significant financial losses. Then there's the, there's the digital divide. The disparity in access to technology between different socioeconomic groups is known as the digital divide. Ethical computing includes efforts to bridge this gap. For example, providing affordable internet access and digital literacy programs in underserved communities can help mitigate the digital divide. And there's an environmental impact. The production and disposal of computing devices contribute to environmental degradation. Responsible computing includes efforts to minimize our environmental footprint and technology. So an example, look up green computing. Promoting the recycling of electronic waste and designing energy efficient systems. So things don't just end up in way you China for people to get sick from. Also, it'll be great for us that are making the things. So in conclusion, thank you. So in conclusion, 
ethical and responsible computing is essential for the development of technology that benefits society while minimizing harm. As computing professionals, we have the duty to uphold ethical standards in our work and consider the broader implications and broader implications of our actions. By doing so, we can contribute to more just and equitable digital world. Bon appetit.